Monument Circle right now. Angela, you look great. The weather looks great. Everything looks great. It looks great, and we're going to give you a sneak peek of the stage. The crowd is starting to get bigger. The stage is set. It's definitely hot weather. I know it was warm this afternoon, about 60 degrees for you shoppers today, but it's going to be cooler this evening. So I've been on the hunt for some cute hats, and I found Spider-Man. <laughs> <And a, laughs> isn't he cute? And a Pacers hat. Pacers are in town if you're headed to the Pacers game and you're only going to be in and out of the Pacers game, not spending much time outside. I don't think you need the heavier coat. Now, you will need the coat if you are headed here and bring some festive attire, a blanket to keep warm. And by festive, I mean an elf and a Santa hat doesn't get much more festive than that. So we've got some cute hats and uh, we'll be on the hunt for the next, oh gosh, hour or so for those cute hats. And the, as I mentioned, the stage is set and the crowd is getting bigger already. And I know I'm not the only one happy that it is not raining this year and it's not too cold. So if you're headed downtown, a little different configuration than years past. So maybe allow a little extra time, grab a cute hat and we hope to see you down here. Circle of Lights forecast is a good one. Temperatures today may at close to 60 degrees across central Indiana, and we'll stay in the upper 40s and low 50s for the next few hours. Now, skies are clear right now, but keeping a close eye on a little boundary that's setting up across parts of Wisconsin, Minnesota, and Iowa, you'll notice a thin line of rain associated with that weak weather system. The good news, this is a fast mover. It heads our way, so with Future Track 13, you can see over the next few hours we're clear, but late tonight, first thing Saturday morning, clouds thicken. Can't rule out a couple of showers either late tonight or around sunrise Saturday. The good news, between, say, 7 a.m. and noon, the cloud deck pushes out with this weather system, and that will set us up for a sunny afternoon. Now, it won't be as warm as it was today. Temperatures will be down. Oh, 10 degrees or so. So if you're headed to the big game tomorrow, up, up in Lafayette, West Lafayette, at Ross 8, it's the old Oak and Bucket game. That is a noon kickoff with temperatures in the mid-40s. It'll be a northwest wind at 15 that makes it feel a little cooler, but the sunshine working in our favor. High temperatures tomorrow afternoon will be in the upper 40s and low 50s. Speaking of football, we've got another big game on Sunday. This one at Lucas Oil, the Colts in town to take on uh, Tennessee. Temperatures for tailgating will be in the 40s. If you have to travel and you're not just enjoying the rest of the holiday weekend with some football, a big view of Future Track 13 shows pretty quiet weather. We have been so lucky this holiday weekend and really the only trouble spots through the end of the weekend will be the Pacific Northwest in Northern California. Our seven-day forecast is a good one. Low 50s, morning clouds maybe a sprinkle and some sunshine tomorrow afternoon, near 50 again on Sunday. Monday and Tuesday will be mild. If you haven't hung the Christmas lights, I would do it early in the week. Rain chances will return late Wednesday into early Thursday. So Carlos, Carlos, um, the crowd is getting bigger and everyone getting so excited. We're not very far from the lighting of Monument Circle. Such a is, special time of year. Is that Winter Wonderland playing behind you that I hear? Are they playing Winter Wonderland? <laughs> But it's, uh, it's good, and I promise you I will not ruin it by singing along. Okay, good. The dancing's fine. Just a little, little, little shivery there. That's okay. There you go. Angela Buckman, we'll check back with you, with you a little bit.